We use manual resuscitators or AMBO bag for multitude of purposes. How about the functional analysis of the manual resuscitator? This is Anesthesia Tools. Keep watching InstaTalk and follow the page. Here is the structural diagram of a typical manual resuscitator. At the patient end, you can find the patient port, the inspiratory valve. In the other end, you can find the reservoir bag is attached and an oxygen tubing is attached. And you can find the bag refill valve, the air entrainment valve and this spillover valve. During inspiration, you can find the inspiratory valve moves forward. The bag gets emptied into the patient interface and when patient exhales, the valve gets closed and the exhale gas goes through the exhalation port. At the other end, what is happening is when the self-inflating bag is cased, bag refill valve closes and when it pre-expands, the bag refill valve allows influx of air or oxygen mixture into the self-inflating bag. You can also note the reservoir bag emptying and refilling and the other two valves air entrainment valve and spillover valve opens and closes as per requirement only. Now let us see what happens when the self-inflating bag is squeezed. Because of the pressure the inspiratory valve gets pushed out and bag refill valve pushed out to get closed. That is how unidirectional flow is ensured. Now you can see when the self-inflating bag re-expands due to the negative pressure, the inspiratory valve gets closed and the bag refill valve opens allowing the flow of gases inside the self-inflating bag. Here you can see the oxygen tubing allowing oxygen into the reservoir bag because at this point of time bag refill valve is closed. The reservoir bag keeps expanding and after a point the spillover valve gives way and the excess oxygen is vented out. When excess inflow demand is there which cannot be met by oxygen tubing or the reservoir bag, the air entrainment valve opens allowing air to get into the self-inflating bag through the bag refill valve. Please remember to leave your comments here and follow Anesthesia Tools Insta Talks. Thank you.